with spotlight vote buying, party primaries, defections, PVC collection, other issues as a race to 2019 gathers momentum. What are the important numbers saying? And the All Progressives Congress APC welcomes back former governor of Kano State, Ibrahim Shakara, who is new as they can be to their side. Many thanks for joining everyone. This is Politics Today live on Channels Television. I'm Shua Kimalue in Lagos. Let's begin tonight uh, by giving you some of the sight and sound of what happened today in Kano State, where the former governor of the state, Ibrahim Shekarao, has returned to his uh, old party, the APC, the former governor and the leader uh, in the state, defected to the All Progressives Congress. Mr. Shikara, who spoke with APC officials in Canada, explained that he had taken the decision after due consultations with members of his constituency, supporters, and stakeholders. I had the singular honor of being the chief midwife of APC. And therefore, it is a kind of homecoming. And since we left, I have interacted peacefully as part of our culture and tradition that we relate with every person regardless of his political opinion. Well, it is 161 days to the general election and the INEC chairman is talking tough on vote buying. The voting population is changing. The parties are getting ready for their primaries. We'll provide those important numbers for you, but I guess we'll, we'll give you some political stories you're following for you at this time. Okay, then we'll bring you those uh, stories across some of the parts of the country at some point on the program. Let's move on quickly to our major story of the day. Over 84 million Nigerians have registered to vote in the 2019 general elections under the Independent National Electoral Commission's continuous voter uh, registration exercise. The Commission's chairman, Professor Mahmoud Yakubu, gave the figures by giving an account of the exercise, which ended on August the 31st. A total of 14,551,482 new voters were registered. If this figure is added to the existing register of 69,720,350 voters. It means that the nation now has a voter population of 84,271,832. Now, today, the INEC chairman also met with political parties appealing to them to conduct credible primaries so as to make free and fair and credible elections in 2019 possible. And Eki is also warning political parties against vote buying promises to make scapegoats in Australian elections ahead of the general elections next year. Looking forward to the Oshun state governorship election to make a very definitive statement on vote buying. We are right now working with the security agencies. We shall arrest, we shall prosecute, and make public show of how not to behave in a democracy. 